More breaking news tonight, this time in Bronzeville, and it is exclusive video you'll see only on two. A view from our drone as Chicago police chase suspects in a stolen car. The police chase ended in a crash and two people arrested. CBS 2 Sabrina Franza was there and has more wild video to show us. Sabrina, what happened? This was absolutely crazy. We were working on a completely different story at the time when we heard the sirens getting closer and closer to us. And within seconds, our photojournalist Alfredo Roman had our CBS2 drone in the air, and we saw something that happens all too often in our city, but in real time. Eyes on that black Kia. You're watching state police survey the area. The Kia turns the corner. Sources say people inside were suspected of three armed robberies in a stolen car. They veer into an empty lot, try to escape the police, the ISP safe unit, statewide anti-violence enforcement. Then the car jumps the curb. It's driving on the sidewalk for blocks. Multiple police cars tail this Kia. It narrowly escapes, crosses an intersection, makes another turn only to be boxed in. The car collides with a pole. One person inside takes off on foot. Our camera still rolling while that person leaves the Kia behind and makes a run for the trees. He ran over there. In the bushes somewhere, they ain't found him. Sources tell CBS2 that police took two people into custody. One was a female previously thrown from the car by the juvenile passenger. Then that passenger hopped in the driver's seat and kept going until they crashed. Neighbors tell us they're thankful this all ended across the street. And of course, we are still working to confirm more details. We saw one firearm being taken into evidence, but we still don't know who was in that car, what exactly happened, and if any charges will be filed. We're live in Bronzeville. Sabrina Franza, CBS Ooh. 2 News. Incredible perspective there. Sabrina, thank you.